Hey guys, I just thought I'd do a quick video on a 2D movement controller. Um, a lot of the stuff I found online is either outdated or just doesn't give you that like really tight and smooth feeling of movement. Um, so let me just quickly demo it to you. Uh, it's based on uh, Raycasts and um, Boxcasts, so not rigid bodies. So it basically means you can get really tight movement. So you're able to go up these slopes and then there's a max slope up there doesn't let you go up them. You can pass through these um, platforms as well. Uh, there are moving platforms which you can then climb up onto like that. Uh, the, there are other objects that interact with these moving platforms. So um, these are enemies and I've set up the enemies so that you can't pass through them. So as a player you get stuck on them and you might be able to notice that even the enemies are able to move the player like so. Uh, there's actually an ally up there. Uh, let me get up to it in a second over here. Ooh, right there. Okay, so you can move through allies. I've set it up like that. So if you set up your collisions or collision masks, sorry, or your tags, you'll be able to set it up however you want. Um, so again, to demo that you'll slide down a max slope. You can climb slopes as you wish. Uh, there's also the ability to wall jump. So you can climb up like that. We'll jump from side to side. Uh, one moment like that. Ooh. We'll jump from side to side. Yeah. <laughs> Messing up the controls of it there. And then uh, again to show you that you can slide up and down these slopes. So you can climb them pretty smooth and there's no change in velocity. So this is what using a uh, raycast allows you to do. And then you slide off of that wall. I just wanted to show you this. Sometimes bugs where it can phase through a ceiling, that's taken care of. Um, and also if you go up to a wall like that, you don't get phased through it. And uh, that's about it really. Um, just to show you a couple more niche case scenarios that it doesn't get stuck on them or phase through them. Uh, you can also kind of jump off a slide, you know, you can break the slide down to come off like that. Uh, again, you can adjust all these things, all the variables, how fast you can move and how high you can jump and so on and so forth. Uh, there's also the ability if you, while you're in the air, if you press down, you'll kind of go down really quickly, like kind of a ground pound move type thing. Um, and that's about it, really. Uh, you can climb up walls, you can go up real quickly like that. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy it. I'll uh, link the uh, GitHub repo description uh, feel free to use it and stuff uh, and uh, yeah like um, like I said earlier the this has been like kind of adapted but quite heavily now so it's very different from a, a Sebastian lag series of videos from a while back um, I'll link them feel free to like go through them if you want to start from scratch but like I said I've changed it quite a bit so it'll be quite different but I've commented it so you should be able to follow along um, it's also set up so that if you don't want to go through it, you can just plug and play and use it how you wish. Um, but yeah, um, thanks for watching and hope it helps you with your project.